methodology called social cartography, creative social cartographies, which is a way of mapping social phenomena using metaphors. The metaphor of the bus. So if you if you think about um, the idea that there is a whole bus of people inside of you that represent all the experiences that you have had before in your life. Uh, especially the traumas that you have had as a child or your mom is also in the bus, your dad. And, and um, there are people at the front of the bus, in the middle of the bus, at the back of the bus. And uh, there's a driver, but sometimes the drivers change. And this metaphor helps us uh, sit with our own complexity before we can sit with the complexity of the world. But in that metaphor, there are also layers. So the bus has different decks where for example, in one deck, it's just your life, but then the next deck is all your ancestors, all the people, <laughs> the historic, the history and the genealogy where you come from. And then in another deck, there's the whole of humanity there. In another deck, there's the humans and non-humans there. And you have all of that in inside of you because it, this is coming from the idea that we are uh, entangled with everything. We're not separate from the land. We're not separate from each other. We are entangled with everything and we sense a, a lot more than what we register in our minds. So for example, if the land is hurting and if other people are hurting, we might be sensing it as well because uh, sometimes we don't numb to that. And then we, in our societies, we don't know what to do with it. And then we feel depressed or anxious. But uh, from indigenous communities, we are learning that if we understand that we are not separate, that there are other capacities that our body has to deal with this collectively that need to be activated. So in our collective, the role of art is to activate these capacities and we call them exiled capacities. And the activation of the exiled capacities can happen through the intellect, through emotions, through relations, through land-based approaches. It can happen in many different ways, but the art is one important way.